RMX 593. We called it the X, a mutated version of smallpox, an act of terrorism after North Korea spread their virus to America. With one side effect, the X had a slight takeover on the brain's memory intake, filling in all the holes and gaps with the best supplement, fear. Spread by the slightest touch to an open wound, eventually this was spread and people began to lose their humanity and their sanity. This resulted in all sorts of things you know as crime, theft, rape, cannibalism, and massacre by the thousands. I am from Camp 94, seemingly the closest thing to a sanctum of peace, standing between us only fences and our own nerves. We live in an American refuge camp located in Germany's forests. We have lived there for three years now, but I'm afraid we're out of food and out of ammunition. The Germans call the monsters and us. They'll be watching us. Tomorrow we are migrating into Camp 96. It's a seven mile walk and no shelter from the insanas. Tomorrow we go together or we die together. Come on, let's pack up the supplies. Let's get moving. Come on, guys. All right, guys, I'll take the front. Taylor, you take the back. Boys, you get the middle. We got a long ways to go. Tyron and Taylor won't will protect us. Seven seven miles. Oh, I'm good. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Those are poisonous. No. Come on, let's go. Taylor's just hearing things again. We need to stop. I'm not stupid, Tyron. I know they're out there. They've been following us for a while now. Taylor, trust my judgment. And saunas are not going to do anything. They won't. They don't follow our movement. Look at the case of Camp 13. They killed and infected everybody in less than 30 minutes. I'm aware of that, sir. But it's getting dark, and these insanas, they always travel in small groups. But now they just seem more strategic, and I'm thinking they're probably waiting for us to separate and pick us off bit by bit. They don't think like that. They're mindless animals. You're very wrong. They are intelligent. We need to scan the perimeter. Everybody, grab your weapons, scan around, look around. Son? Yeah, you should build that someday. Maybe we can both do that someday. Sounds good.
hopefully that night I survived. I climbed up the train the Insana's gonna climb, and I slept there. That train was my home base for the day, but I had to keep moving. I feel so lucky. I'm too lucky. As far as I know, I'm the only one alive. Sometimes I wish I was dead. It'd be easier. As far as I know, I'm the only one alive. 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 After I lost my group, I had to climb a tree and go to sleep there. Tyron says that, that saunas are too stupid to climb, so if you get separated, you climb. <laughs> it worked. I'm here, and I'm awake, and alive. My first thought was that I needed water. I was just so scared, and then fear turned into anger. I just got so mad that my group had left. I just wanted to scream and hit everything. I knew I needed to conserve my energy, but I still needed water, and my thirst got to me. I ran for hours until I found a lake. I knew I was tired, but my thirst... I shouldn't have drank the water. Something in it made me sick. I woke up and I didn't know where I was. We're in Camp 96. I thought I died. You're lucky you didn't die. I was heading, I knew where Camp 96 was, so I was heading there and I saw you passed out by the lake, so I brought you here. Something was in the water, I guess after I drink it and the uh, pool. Where's everyone else? Yeah, well, Tyron wanted to take the kids another way because he figured he knew where it was. So I went the right way because he'd already gotten us in trouble and got one killed before. And then next time I came across them, they'd been mangled and eaten. What's that noise? Ah, don't worry about it. There's a lot of funny noises around here. Now, if you excuse me, I gotta go work on some plumbing. The ladies in this camp don't know a thing about it. Ah! Ah!
I've got to get that in sauna.